Shark CH951 cordless vacuum. Ordered on Amazon a couple of months ago. It does well. It picks up most things, but we found a couple of things it has trouble with. We have a big oak tree in our front yard that produces acorns, and we happen to track those acorns in from time to time. Let's see if we can pick these up. Like I said, it picks up most things, but it has trouble with these, and we have these all over the house, so the vacuum doesn't quite come in handy with this. I'll just do a uh, zoom in on this. You see it, it actually goes up into the, uh, into the vacuum, but then comes right back out. Kind of does a little dance in there. These aren't that heavy. So I'm surprised it's having trouble with it. So unfortunately, I can't give this a uh, five out of five stars. If it could pick these up, this would be a surefire thing. Here's the stand that you can purchase separately. And if you flip it over, I've already got my cord tied in so I want to show you because I thought it was kind of stupid that you have to pick up the thing every time to plug it in so we have our cord and you see it's got this funny rectangular end on the end you plug it in right here And you twist it. It's in there. Works perfect. So all you gotta do is it's plugged in. tip I thought this was broken at first because it doesn't clip in but once you turn it on the suction holds it in place Test of the shark vacuum under our couch.
right, so I picked up the shark cyclone for pet. No, we don't have that kind of pet. Um, but I mainly more got this for in my office. I do well in workshop. I do a lot of 3D printing and other sort of things and make a lot of mess. And um, we have central vac, so hauling that out to just clean up little jobs is kind of pain. So then I don't do it. And it's just messy. So if I have a hopefully small ish rechargeable vacuum here, then I'll be more inclined to clean up, right? That's the theory at least. Um, so, charging cable. I'm just making sure none of these other things are cardboard protection here. So, a uh, yeah. brush like carpet attachment, I would presume. And so, QR code to. I don't know, get info about it or something, I guess. Uh, you can register just by clicking that. So fancy. Um, so yeah, USB A to USB C cable and instruction manual. So let me look over that and make sure I understand how to use it. All right, so everything looked pretty self-explanatory um, on, off switch there, uh, charging there. Um, this is the release to uh, get to the filter. So when it's full, you uh, or you want to empty it right where it says pull and dump out your stuff. We're back in and click. Yes, it does. I did it once. I don't have it lined up correctly. There we go. And uh, so then we've got a attachment for crevices, things like that. And then the uh, pet whatever pet extraction tool i'm not sure you want to extract your pet but i guess this helps get um for another sort of things we do have feathers in our house um so i don't know interested to see what that does here um so it's you know moderately loud um and actually getting some of the dust off my table which is nice. So I'll take that. Um, so you can obviously just use it in this mode. Which is doing just fine. And of course then you can so it's uh, getting up some of the dust here for sure. So I will take that. Again, a little bit of noise, but I'm not uh, complaining about that. It is uh, doing a great little job. So, so I'll be interested to uh, see how long it takes to charge, how long it kind of runs on um, on a charge there. And... Uh, no, I didn't really. Well, you can see stuff in there. So, um, you know, obviously it's a well-known name that I trust, and I expected it to be good. Um, this is the main thing that I'm going to be doing in my, um, you know, workshop area. And it looks like we have a little protective covering on there that I didn't know we had. So get rid of that. Um, yeah, so I love it. Lightweight, um, not that 
not that huge. Um, so I'll just be able to hang that somewhere out of the way. And uh, yeah, this will be helpful at uh, keeping my little area a bit cleaner without having to pull out the big giant uh, central back coast. So I'm going to call this a win. I'm a happy camper and hope that helps you out. Take care. Have a good day and be clean, y'all.